The cleric is the final line of defense. If the resistance compromises it, we are doomed. There's nothing we can't do. It's real. Burn it. Cleric, I can only hope one day to be as uncompromising as you. You're a family man. Yes, sir, a boy and a girl. Disturbing rumor. Rumor, sir. A rumor maintaining that one of the cleric is actually attempting to contact the resistance. Then you know what I'm gonna do now. Yeah. Preston, give me yourself. Entirely without incident. No. Not without incident. sometime within the next 100 years. The most probable result will be a rather sudden and uncontrollable decline in both population and industrial capacity. And what they don't say here that they said in the, in the secret report is that the masses of people in the world will result to the overthrow of their government and anarchy will reign as they try to feed themselves and their families and find jobs. It is possible to alter these growth trends and to establish a condition of ecological and economic stability that is sustainable far into the future. The state of global equilibrium could be designed so that the basic material needs of each person on Earth are satisfied and each person has an equal opportunity to realize his individual human potential. Who would suffer the most under such a plan? Not the rich, ladies and gentlemen. They are in control. It's going to be us, Americans, consume most of the raw materials in the world. 50% of the energy supply is consumed in this country. We pollute the earth more than any other nation. It is us who are going to have to go back and live like our ancestors did, and they're going to make us if we don't learn how to do it on our own. I'd rather be a volunteer than a slave. I don't know about you. If the world's people decide to strive for the second outcome rather than the first, the sooner they begin working to attain it, the greater will be their chances of success. And down in the last paragraph, something really important. These conclusions are so far-reaching and raise so many questions for further study that we are quite frankly overwhelmed by the enormity of the job that must be done. We hope that this book will serve to interest other people in many fields of study and in many countries of the world to raise the space and time horizons of their concerns and to join us in an, outs in an understanding and preparing for a period, and listen to this because they're not kidding, it's coming very soon, for a period of great transition, the transition from global to global equilibrium. 
Henry Kissinger said when asked what he foresaw for the coming decade, he said, everything will be different. There will be a new world order. Many will suffer. For those who survive, the world will be better. And the last thing he said, we will have the world we have always wanted. Now if you know anything about Henry Kissinger, he never wastes words, and he knows what's going on. Next. 